Breaking news, who are the Houthis of Yemen and what motivates them to attack ships in the Red Sea? In what they claim is an effort to back Palestinians in the Gaza war, the Iran-aligned Houthis of Yemen are upping their involvement in the Middle Eastern conflict by targeting ships in the Red Sea and launching missiles and drones at Israel.U.S. Defense Secretary Lloyd Austin launched a multinational operation to protect Red Sea commerce on Tuesday in reaction to the Houthi attacks. The Houthis' involvement has heightened regional concerns related to the conflict, endangering sea lanes that transport a significant amount of oil globally and causing concern among Red Sea states as Houthi missiles and drones approach Israel. Tell me about the Houthis. The BOKS, the Houthi family of northern Yemen, established a religious revival movement in the late 1990s for the Zaidi sect of Shariite Islam. The Zaidis have formerly dominated Yemen but saw their homeland in the north fall into poverty and marginalization. They clashed briefly across the border with Sunni superpower Saudi Arabia and fought a succession of guerrilla wars with the National Army as tensions with the government escalated, surging influence with the capture of Sana'a in late 2014, they entered the Yemen war and quickly rose to prominence. In 2015, Saudi Arabia led a coalition backed by the West to support the government of Yemen, out of concern over the increasing influence of Shariite Iran along its border, while the internationally recognized government set up shop in Aden, the Houthis took over most of the northern region and other major population centers, amidst a peace push spearheaded by the United Nations. Yemen has experienced over a year of relative calm. The Saudis have been trying to end the conflict by talking to the Houthis. Involvement in the Mideast conflict Houthis joined the fray as the latest crisis swept across the Middle East, pledging to keep attacking until the Israeli aggression stops and announcing on October 31st that they had launched missiles and drones at Israel. Their behavior is reminiscent of that of Iraqi militias that have opened fire on American interests in Iraq and Syria, as well as the Iranian-backed Lebanese group. Hezbollah, which has been attacking Israeli positions along the border with Lebanon on December 9, the Houthis issued a stern warning to all international shipping companies not to do business with Israeli ports and said they would attack any ship going to Israel, regardless of its nationality. All ships in the Red Sea bound for Israeli ports, regardless of their nationality, will become a target for our armed forces if Gaza does not receive the food and medicine it needs, the Houthi spokesperson warned in a statement released on December 9 that which the Houthis called death to America, death to Israel, curse the Jews and victory to Islam is their rallying cry. Links to Iran the U.S. has reason to suspect that the Houthi missile and drone attacks are being plotted and executed by the Islamic Revolutionary Guard Corps of Iran, IT is imperative that Iran discontinues its backing of Houthi attacks on commercial vessels, as stated by U.S. Defense Secretary Lloyd Austin on December 18. Iran maintains its innocence. The Houthis have been accused of receiving arms, training, and funding from Iran by the Saudi led coalition for a long time. The Houthis insist they create their own weaponry and reject the idea that they are an Iranian proxy. ARSENAL in their assaults on Saudi Arabia and the UAE, the Houthis showcased their missile and drone capabilities while fighting in Yemen. They targeted oil installations and important infrastructure, more than a thousand miles away from their capital in Sana'a. The arsenal consists of armed drones and ballistic missiles that can strike Israel. Experts say that it's Tofen, Borkin, and Quds missiles which are based on Iranian weapons, are capable of hitting targets up to 2,000 kilometers, 1,200 miles, away. Throughout the conflict in Yemen, the Houthis launched these missiles at Saudi Arabia on multiple occasions. The Houthis displayed a MiG-29 fighter jet, helicopters, anti-aircraft Bark II missiles, naval missiles, and more for the first time in September, when attacking ships, the Houthis have also made use of fast boats outfitted with machine guns.